What happens if you warn Sedonis during Garrus' loyalty mission, Eye for an Eye? Keep watching to discover all outcomes and unique dialogue. What's up everyone, Big Dan here. Before we begin, I have a bunch of different Mass Effect trilogy guides and lore videos on my channel, so if you're interested in seeing more, hit that subscribe button. Without further ado, let's dive right in. During Mass Effect 2, Garrus will ask you to help him deal with a personal matter related to his time in a Merc gang on Omega. One of his crew members, Lantar Sedonis, lured Garrus' team into a trap, which led to all ten of them being killed. Garrus asks Shepard to take him to the Citadel so he can locate Sedonis and kill him. Since the first Mass Effect game, Garrus has always been a bit of a renegade. His side quest in Mass Effect involved a similar mission to track down and kill someone who evaded justice. In that case, it was a Salarian doctor named Salion who performed unethical experiments and organ harvesting for personal profit. Shepard's leadership can influence Garrus to a more paragon path or cater to his more renegade sense of justice. There's no escape this time, Doctor. I'd harvest your organs first, but we don't have the time. You're crazy. He's crazy! Please, don't let him do this to me! Put him out of his misery so we can get going. Gladly. After tracking down Harkin on the Citadel and setting up a meeting with Sedonis, Garrus and Shepard take a Skycar to the meeting point. At this moment, Garrus is dead set on killing Sedonis and nothing Shepard says can convince him otherwise. The pain and heartache in Garrus' voice is palpable as he entertains the thought that Sedonis would evade justice for his crimes. I've always hated injustice. The thought that Sedonis could get away with this. Why should he go on living while ten good men lie in unmarked graves? I'm sorry, Shepard. Words aren't going to solve this problem. Once Shepard arrives at the meeting point, we have two options. Let Garrus take the shot, or warn Sedonis. Let's explore what happens when we warn him. Listen, Sedonis. I'm here to help you. Don't ever say that name aloud. I'm a friend of Garrus's. He wants you dead, but I'm hoping that's not necessary. Garrus, is this some kind of joke? Damn it, Shepard. If he moves, I'm taking the shot. You're not kidding, are you? Screw this. I'm not sticking around here to find out. Tell Garrus I had my own problems. At this point, if we don't intervene with a Paragon interrupt, then Garrus will take the shot. Betrayal repaid Sidonis. However, if we hit that Paragon Interrupt, then Shepard will step in to protect Sedonis. Screw this. I'm not sticking around here to find out. Tell Garrus I had my own problems. Don't move. Get off me! I'm the only thing standing between you and a hole in the head. Fuck. Look, I didn't want to do it. I didn't have a choice. Everyone has a choice. They got to me. Said they'd kill me if I didn't help. What was I supposed to do? Let me take the shot, Shepard. He's a damn coward. At this point, we could still let Garrus take the shot. I'm with Garrus on this one. What? Shit. Betrayal repaid Sidonis. But let's see what happens if we keep him talking instead. That's it? You were just trying to save yourself? I know what I did. I know they died because of me. I have to live with that. I wake up every night, sick and sweating. Each of their faces staring at me, accusing me. I'm already a dead man. I don't sleep. Food has no taste. Some days, I just want it to be over. Just give me the chance. If that's what you want. No more sleepless nights. For either of us, Sidonis. Thank you. If we choose the option, I can't help you, Shepard will again walk away and let Garrus take the shot. I can't help you, Sidonis. No more sleepless nights. For either of us, Sidonis. Thank you. We can also try to convince Garrus to stand down with a Paragon speech check. 
He's already paying for his crime, Garrus. Let him go. He's still got more to pay. Ten men are dead because of him. Will killing the Eleventh bring them back? They... they deserve better. Tell Garrus... I guess there's nothing I can say to make it right. Just... go. Tell him to go. He's letting you go. You're a better man than I am, Garrus. Thank you. Garrus' response here will be slightly different if you don't have enough Paragon points, but he will still allow Sedonis to live. You gotta let it go, Garrus. He's already paying for his crime. He hasn't paid enough. He still has his life. Look at him, Garrus. He's not alive. There's nothing left to kill. My men, they deserved better. Tell Garrus... I guess there's nothing I can say to make it right. Just... go. Tell him to go. He's giving you a second chance, Sidonis. Don't waste it. I'll try, Garrus. I'll make it up to you somehow. Thank you for talking to him. There are two different post-mission conversations with Garrus. If he shot Sidonis, he will say this. That was easy enough. Clean and simple. Good work. Thanks for helping me, Shepard. Let's get moving. I need to get away from this place. That was easy enough. This is what happens when you let things get personal. I need to know this is over. Yeah, it's over. I can move on. Glad to hear it. Thanks for helping me, Shepard. Let's get moving. I need to get away from this place. If you convinced him to spare Sidonis, he will say this instead. I know you want to talk about this, but I don't. Not yet. I know it didn't go the way you planned, but I think it's for the best. I'm not so sure. Give it time. Yeah. Maybe that'll be enough. I want to know I did the right thing, not just for me. For my men. They deserve to be avenged. But when Sedonis was in my sights, I just couldn't do it. The lines between good and evil blur when we're looking at people we know. Yeah, there was still good in him. I could see it. So much easier to see the world in black and white. Gray. I don't know what to do with Gray. You gotta go with your instincts. My instincts are what got me into this mess. Don't be too hard on yourself. Thanks, Shepard. For everything. Let's get going. I need some distance from this place. I'm with you. I know you want to talk about this, but I don't. Not yet. Let's go then. Right with you. Have you got a minute? Sure, just killing time anyway. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Sedonis. Whatever happens with the Collectors or the Reapers or whoever else comes after us, I know you'll get the job done. The next time you go to the Citadel, Edie will give an update related to this quest. If Garrus killed Sedonis, Edie will say this. CSEC appears to be investigating the death of Sedonis, Shepard. They currently have no leads. What a shame. If Garrus spared him, then Edie will say this instead. According to CSEC reports, Harkin was taken into custody and charges are pending. That's the least that bastard deserves. Regardless of which route you choose during the quest, you will earn Garrus' loyalty and unlock his armor-piercing ammo ability. There are no long-term ramifications to this quest for Mass Effect 3, and we don't encounter Sedonis again. If Sedonis is still alive, there will be a galactic news report that informs us he turned himself into CSEC and confessed his involvement in the deaths of Garrus' crew on Omega. However, CSEC doesn't know how to handle this since there is no formal government on Omega, which also lies outside CSEC jurisdiction. So what is the best outcome for this quest? In general, I feel that it's best to convince Garrus to spare Sedonis. This gives Sedonis an opportunity to atone for his crimes and perhaps make a positive contribution in the world. But the ending where Garrus shoots Sedonis after speaking with him seems fitting as well. It gives both Sedonis and Garrus a sense of peace, with Sedonis saying no more sleepless nights, and Garrus capping it off with for either of us. But on the other hand, this also seems like the easy way out for both of them. Garrus killing Sedonis does nothing to bring back his men, or make any positive impact on the larger world. And Sedonis is able to slip away from life without really confronting what he did, or making amends for it. So in the end, I usually convince Garrus to spare Sedonis, unless I'm doing a full-on renegade run. So there you have it. 
what happens if you warn Sedonis in Mass Effect 2? If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to Big Dan Gaming for more Mass Effect and RPG videos. Until next time, this has been Big Dan. I should go.